enacted, it covered only unemployed and retired workers in commercial and industrial occupations. On August 14, 1935, President Roosevelt signed the bill, saying, We must face the fact that in this country, we have a rich man's security and a poor man's security, and that the government owes equal obligations to both. There is still today a frontier that remains unconquered, an America unreclaimed. This is the great, the nationwide frontier of insecurity, of human want and human fear. This is the frontier, the America, that we have set ourselves to reclaim. Between 1939 and 1957, dependents, farm and domestic workers, state and local government employees became eligible. By 1976, Social Security covered 90% of the workforce.